Hi, my name is Jeff and I'm a co-founder of Lobo Leads and I believe my wife Megan spoke with Sissy recently about a quick website audit and pass along your information to show you where your company is currently ranking and what your competitors are doing to claim the top spots on Google. So in this video, we'll go over a few specifics on how to rank your site and how to beat your competition online. So the three things I wanted to go over with you today are content, backlinks, and citations. Now content is anything on the front page of your site that Google can read. So all the text on the front page, all the text within your images, and what your images are actually saved as uh, are all things that Google can read. Now to be considered authority in Google's eyes, you're going to want to have at least 1,500 to 2,000 words on your front page. And you're going to want it to be stuffed with content that has to do with buyer intent. So for you specifically, you'd be looking at things like electrician Denton, Texas, Denton electrician, and other keyword phrases along those lines. That way, when anyone types in those searches into Google, your website will be the one that pops up. Now, taking a look at your website, I really like how clean and professional it is. It's very easy to navigate. You have your different tabs up here, separating out the different types of services that you can um, that you can provide. There's lots of internal linking, uh, anything where you can click into here. Um, that is heavily favored by Google as a way of making your website e easier to uh, and more user friendly. Um, now, uh, some uh, suggestions I would make for you. Um, just like I said before, uh, you do want your home page to be geared towards about 1,500 to 2,000 words of content. And we typically suggest that you keep your keyword phrases to about one to uh, 150 um, content words per keyword phrase. So 100 to 150 per one keyword phrase. So that gets you about 10 keywords on your home page. And then for these separate um, service pages, uh, also known as back pages, uh, you'll want to uh, shoot for 500 words of content, again, getting about five keywords in each one of those. And what that does is it allows you to uh, potentially rank you those separate pages for um, the specific services that people are searching for. And so, um, so I get to take a little bit to load that page here. Um, now, uh, one last suggestion I would make uh, would be to include some uh, customer testimonials as well as some additional pictures of actual projects that you may have completed if you have before and afters. People love those. Um, and then just going back to the testimonials, um, that just builds a whole nother level of trust whenever someone visits your site and sees another customer saying, Wow, uh, 308 did such a great job. I'll definitely hire them again for my next project, so on and so forth. So it's a really easy way to build a lot of trust in a short amount of time. Now, um, the next thing I wanted to talk to you about today is something called backlinks. The thing with Google is that it can be like a popularity contest because they judge you based on how many websites are pointing back at you. But it's very important to remember not all backlinks are created equal. So you're going to get a lot more influence from a backlink that is uh, related to your industry, for example an electrician blog that mentions your company or a popular website that features various types of home services something that has to do with the services that you offer and so you're gonna have a lot more uh, influence and power coming from that type of backlink versus uh, something from like your local Domino's pizza that has nothing to do with the actual services that you provide we do have a tool to measure um, backlinks and their quality it's called Arif's and uh, I went ahead and plugged your website in here, the home page. And as you can see, you have 84 backlinks from 10 referring domains. And what that means is there's 10 different websites pointing back to you 84 times. And what that uh, that's not generating any traffic though. And so um, it looks like there may need to be some tweaking in there, either of your keywords that uh, you're targeting or the quality of the backlinks that, that you're getting. Um, there's a lot more that goes into it as far as that goes and we'd be happy to discuss it further with you but that is the top way to boost your ranking uh, with google is to make sure that you have those things working in conjunction the keywords and your backlinks um, so what we did is we take a look at one of your top competitors here it looks like it's denton electric 
They have 211 backlinks, so not that many more backlinks uh, from 37 referring domains. Uh, however, their organic traffic, as you can see, is 93, and that's on a monthly basis. So there's 93 uh, visitors to their site in the last month. And um, as you can probably imagine, if you can even convert a handful of those into paying customers, then you've increased your revenue by that much more. Um, the last thing that I wanted to talk to you about today is something called citations. Citations are very important because what they do is uh, whenever someone clicks on or goes to Google and runs a search for uh, electrician in Denton, Texas, I think Texas was the best one that I found. Uh, typical stuff that's going to pop up are going to be the um, paid advertisements up here and then you have what's called down here a Google map pack and as you can see it does take up a lot of real estate on the first page of Google and the way to get into this map pack is something called a citation and citations are literally just the name address and phone number of your business listed on the various um, directories online that's going to be Yelp, uh, Better Business Bureau, Porch, House, Home Advisor, Angie. Um, there's hundreds of them out there. So just the more of those that you have with your business information, the higher you will rank here. And uh, you do want to get up here because 70% uh, of the people that click into this map pack end up going with the top spot. So you do get a lot of traffic going to that top number one position. Uh, strategy that we typically employ is we go in with the various tools that we have, Eris being one of them, taking a look at what the backlinks are and replicating them for you and then adding a 20 to 30 percent cushion. Again, that's for both backlinks and citations. And essentially by the time your competition realizes what's happening, you've already far surpassed them and as long as you keep on adding backlinks and citations along the way, then you'll keep on crawling up to that top spot and remain in that top spot um uh, garnishing all that additional all that additional volume and traffic as customers so um here's our website here Lobo leads marketing uh, this is uh, megan's number to call her back directly if you have any questions or if you'd like to discuss it further we'd be happy to talk about it with you thank you so much again for watching and have an excellent rest of your day